What's up, people? Brandy from Brandy Steel Entertainment, and check this out. It seems like WWE is going to be bringing back one, I'm talking about one now, of the most destructive forces to ever join the WWE, and I'm talking about the Nexus. Now, I don't have any videos of the Nexus, so I'm sorry that you guys are actually going to have to be staring at this picture throughout the whole entire video. And I actually do have a sore throat, so I'm not trying to make this very long. Main reason why I didn't upload, you know, the past two days was because of that, but I'm not going to get into that. Basically, Ryback actually did a whole media type of thing for Thursday Night SmackDown moving to the USA Network, and he actually did mention that few people backstage WWE as well as WWE creative were really thinking about having a whole Nexus reunion type of thing now if you didn't notice uh, there's a few people from the Nexus that currently aren't signed with the WWE now the apparently they have a resolution for that you know basically what they were thinking is that they were gonna get Bo Dallas's crew basically Bo Dallas Curtis Axel Heath Slater and uh, Adam Rose Basically, and they were just going to be joining the Nexus. So, uh, of course, he Slater will be in there because he's a part of the original Nexus. Now, I'm not talking about the Nexus that CM Punk was the leader. I'm talking about the original Nexus, where uh, Wade Barrett was actually the leader. On their first night in the WWE, they destroyed John Cena and the whole arena. The announcers, it was absolutely amazing. I didn't know what the hell was going on, but it was absolutely amazing. And the fact that WWE is actually going to be bringing that back is absolutely amazing and to the point where they actually said that it will be exclusively for Thursday Night Smackdown I love it even more because it's not WWE isn't how it was back in the day there is no more draft you know uh, WWE superstars on every single show um, you know a lot of superstars that aren't really getting that much buzz they're on main event in WWE superstars and if you're on Monday Night Raw you're also on Thursday Night Smackdown it's not like how it was back in the day where certain superstars were you know, set to appear only on Thursday Night SmackDown or Friday Night SmackDown at the time or even Monday Night Raw. So the fact that WWE is actually going to be bringing something back exclusively for one show, I think that will be bringing in a lot of views. And the fact that the Nexus actually might be coming back, that will be absolutely amazing. Now, the only thing that's really holding them back at the moment is Wade Barrett. Because Wade Barrett, he is a part of the League of Nations at the moment, but they are losing a lot of buzz. And in my opinion, they won't make it past the Royal Rumble. But... It actually seems like that Wade Barrett is injured, so I'm guessing that they're just waiting to get the okay from Wade Barrett, or as well as the WWE doctors, and then the Nexus is a go. Now, if Daniel Bryan is going to be a part of the Nexus, because he was a part of the original Nexus, that is not known at this moment. But if he does, uh, that, would, that would be absolutely amazing. That would bring even more buzz to Thursday Night SmackDown. The fact that one of WWE's biggest faces... You know, one of the main faces in WWE, Daniel Bryan, turning heel to join the Nexus, or maybe the Nexus will be faced. I don't know. But the fact that, you know, Daniel Bryan will even be back in general, that would be definitely a mark out moment. But we're just going to have to see where this goes. Uh, maybe this might happen. WWE Fastlane, it all depends on Wade Barrett's, you know, whole recovery. But hopefully it will be very fast because I really want to see the Nexus return. But anyways, guys, that's all I have for this video. But you did hear here first. The Nexus might be returning and might be exclusively for Thursday Night Smackdown. But anyways, guys, that's all I have for you in this video. So thank you for stopping by the top daily WWE place to be. I really do appreciate you for watching this video. Plus, if you're new around here, why not the subscribe button, man? Because I do upload WWE content on the daily. Plus, follow me on Twitter, at BrandonSteelENT, because my tweets are awesome. But anyways, guys, I'll be talking to you later.